Good morning everybody. So I'm so happy like I'm gaining weight so quickly and everything is like tight and not tight but the thing is when I wake up first thing I'm very water reten retention. I don't know what the word is but like my rings. Let me show you my hands right now. My ring is so so stuck and it's so tight like if I try and move it a little bit you can probably see like the red line and the same with this one so so stuck and like it even cuts off circulation like my finger is like that when I wake up um so when I wake up in the morning I have a lot of water weight everywhere so everything's tighter when I first get dressed especially because I literally just finished my TPN about 20 minutes ago but I want to show you body update anyway so check out these legs <laughs> I mean they're not different to you guys but like if you see pictures of me wearing these exact same pants they were literally like let me pull it up a bit so you can, like like so baggy not baggy baggy but they were definitely not like this so <laughs> I'm excited and like arm wise I definitely think my arms look a bit like fatter I know this I know I'm still like skinny but I'm definitely gaining weight um, I've gained a couple kilos already, so I'm so excited. Sorry, I can't stop smiling. I just, especially my face. My face looks very fat in the morning, and my eyes are very, very puffy. Um, but that goes down in the day. So, um, but yeah, which is frustrating because my dietitian appointment is 9 a.m. and I don't know if that's going to be enough time for me to absorb some of this water because I don't want it to like weigh. I mean, I'm. Psh, the scales can say whatever they want, do you know what I mean? Like, I want to know what my true weight is, not what my water weight is. And I know a lot of people did say that you will get a lot of water weight at the start. Um, so, you know. Anyway, ugh, it's a bit cold. The fan's still on because it got so hot last night. So I told I put the fan on, but I'm going to do it turning it off. God, I never know how to work these things. Are they gonna make it go really fast or is it turn off? There we go. I think that's slowing down. Um yes, so I'm about to just do my meds, flush my line, put my chore lock in, and then I'm gonna go and get my bloods done. So I'm probably gonna end up with the time now. I think it's like quarter two. So if I hurry up and do all that in the next ten minutes, I should be fine. Anyway, good morning. Let's go get our bloods done. And yeah, I'm feeling good. Yeah, things are definitely starting to turn around for me. I mean, I, don't get me wrong, I'm in quite a lot of pain today. My joint pain's quite bad and I was quite, quite unwell last night. But energy wise, I've been doing so well. Um, and on Wednesday, I have my pain clinic appointment, so I'm hoping we can switch to a patch because I'm not, like, the pain meds I'm on at the moment, they're not working that great, and that's due to, like, absorption. Um, I'm finding I'm having to take more of them to get the same effect, and also, um, they make me very, quite drowsy as well, and I, I can't be going around, like, because I can't drive then. So I have found myself not taking my meds properly because I'm like, oh, I'm going to be a bit like, oh, and out of it. I don't want to get behind the wheel if I'm like that. So I want to try and switch, switch, switch to a patch, which is what we were originally going to do anyway. But then we ended up trying these new meds. But we'll figure that out on Wednesday. And I'm actually seeing the physio on Wednesday as well. The physio, the psychologist, and the, the pain people, they're all like in the same department. And it's all part of the same appointment. Um, which is really good because I really need to know what physio stuff to start doing because they said when you start gaining weight you need to be exercising and doing certain things so anyway that's all to come I'm gonna go get my blood done now so yeah <laughs> hey guys so I'm not feeling that great today it's a bit of an off day um, I'm feeling quite dry and I kind of am like, hmm, should I run fluids? But the thing is, what's the time? Hmm. So the thing is, if I run fluids, it has to be at least four hours because it's plasma light. If it was just normal saline, I could run it as fast as I wanted. 
um but because it's got electrolytes in it you can't run it too quickly they like four hours is what i've been told to run it at so if i start it now it's almost four five six seven eight it's gonna be eight o'clock by the time it finishes and then i basically would have to start my tpn straight after because then my tpn would finish at 8 a.m and i like it to finish semi early-ish like no later than probably nine or ten well, 10's pushing it because I, I don't really want it to finish 10. Um, so the thing is, if I run fluids, then I'm not really going to have much time, like a break between starting my TPN. So maybe I'll just run them tomorrow. Um, I have to show you this. So you guys know I'm a fan of like spiced drinks, like pumpkin spice, um, like chai latte, like this. Like chai latte, because that's like cinnamon and all that kind of thing i don't know if it says no however i am a big big fan of ginger beer i love it so much it's so good especially bundaberg which is an australian i'm pretty sure it's australian anyway it's an australian brand and at christmas they actually bring out spiced ginger beer so it's ginger beer but it's got cinnamon and cloves as like in it as well and it is so nice so good so i think i'm gonna have a bit of that anyway i'm gonna have a little bit of that while i edit i'm currently editing and it keeps telling me that my storage is full and i'm like ugh. so my current situation keeps telling me that the storage device blah 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 is almost full and i have to keep like deleting stuff while i'm trying to edit and it's so so, um, and I also was talking to my friend Caitlin earlier and she said that she needs a hair model for tomorrow. Um, now, I've got a hairdresser's appointment on Friday to get my hair, like a balayage done. Um, and for those of you who don't know what that is, it's basically where you, the colour at the top, it goes lighter as it goes down. So I'll probably keep this colour, which is my natural hair, and then by the end it'll be blonde. Um, now I obviously you can tell I don't have a lot of hair um, So I'm not really sure how nice it's gonna look because my hair is quite thin um, But she needs a hair model for tomorrow to like dye because remember I got my hair dyed by her quite a few months back um, And I just went I just basically went the same color as I am now I just got all the red tones taken out So that's what I'm probably gonna get done tomorrow and then I'm gonna get the balayage done on Friday still so yeah i love getting my hair done i absolutely love like like getting it washed and they give you that little head head massage so because i'm getting my hair washed tomorrow i'll probably have a shower tonight and just wash my body and shave etc i'll probably have a bath because it's easier but yes and i'll probably run fluids tomorrow morning because as you can see my lips are getting quite cracked which is my lips always go like pale and cracked when i'm dehydrated and i can also tell by how much urine i'm producing and i haven't my last wee was 5 a.m and it's now 4 p.m it's almost 12 hours since my last wee um so that's you know quite a big thing for me <laughs> looking kind of crazy um so it is actually the next morning um what is the time it's currently half six i've been up since like half five i woke up went to the toilet and i just could not sleep i keep forgetting that i've got a drawer full of <laughs> you can see sick bags and yet every time i need to be sick i go to the toilet i mean don't get me wrong it's literally just like right outside our door so it's fine but like i don't know like i just keep forgetting that i've got them there and i don't need to rush up with my pole and be like am i gonna make it because i've got a whole drawer full of stuff anyway oh, a lot of you suggested i've just been replying to like comments and stuff on my videos to tape this to my skin but tape like i'm really bad with tape so i'm probably not Gonna, that's probably not gonna work so if you guys do have any other suggestions on ways that I can hide it I know like I could layer my clothes so I could wear like a like a like a vest top underneath certain tops 
which would work but it's getting hotter now and that's not going to work in summer so that's not really ideal winter that'd be fine i could just wear it between layers um assuming that i have it that long like uh, by winter i'm hoping that i'll be off tpn but um for right now tape's not really a good idea i mean i'm happy to wear it just like how it is like out it's just sometimes it can like ruin an outfit but come on this is my lifeline literally <laughs> So, uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not complaining. Anyway, yeah, last night we, well, dad was meant to come home and we were all going to go shopping and get food shopping and decide who's cooking what night. But Ellie was at the hospital again yesterday, so dad was with her, with my mum and also Ethan, who is Ellie's boyfriend, was there. So there was my mum, my dad and Ethan with Ellie. So then me, Francis and dad, me, Francis and Tom... We ended up just going to like the local pub to play some bets on the Melbourne Cup, which I'm not going to get into it. Basically, it's this, this like this Australian tradition, like a it's like the horse races, but it's like huge. Um, so we went just there, and they, we had some dinner there. Um, and they just play some bets or whatever. Anyway, I went in the vlog, but that's basically what you missed. What I didn't vlog. Um, it's been a while since I haven't remembered to end my vlog. I think it was because it was in my bag and I put my bag over there and then I kind of just like got home and I was pretty tired. Today was like, yesterday was kind of like an off day um, and then I just went to bed. So, yeah. Anyway, I love you guys so much. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and hit that subscribe button down below become a part of this little family because it's a nice it's a nice family we're mostly 99.9% .9 of the time a decent place to be around we do get some nasty people around here sometimes but I'm trying not to acknowledge that so ooh, knocking me likes anyway I love you guys and I will see you in today's vlog good night or oh, good morning good night